गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स टुडे वी विल स्टडी चैप्टर सेकेंड वेयर टू बेबीज कम फ्राम सो बिफोर स्टार्टिंग आर चैप्टर लेट्स रिकलेक्ट एज वी हैव ऑलरेडी लर्न अबाउट द सिमिलैरिटी बिटवीन डिफरेंट रिलेशंस ट्विंस एंड हेरिडेटरी फीचर्स इन दिस चैप्टर वी विल लर्न अबाउट द मदर चाइल्ड रिलेशनशिप फोस्टर पेरेंट्स एंड एडोपन सो Let's start our chapter. First point is where do babies come from? All babies whether of humans or of animals come from their mother's body. The process by which living beings produce more of their own kind is called reproduction. In humans and animals females give birth to young ones. Animals that give birth to babies are called mammals. Mammals feed their young ones with their milk. Some animals like birds and reptiles lay eggs from which their young ones hatch. A human baby stays in its mother's womb for 9 months. The baby is fed through a tube that joins the baby to its mother. As the baby grows, it starts moving inside the womb when it is big enough and is ready to take birth it comes out of the mother's body a newborn resembles the members of its family for many months after its birth the baby cannot eat or drink like grown ups do it totally depends on mother's milk there is a natural relationship between a mother and a child the mother keeps her baby close to her and protects the baby from all kinds of danger all mothers possess the natural ability to nurse their babies okay now second point is what is adoption adoption is a process by which couples become legal parents of a child who was not born to them they bring up the adopted child as their own and treat the child as a member of their family they love them and fulfill all the physical and emotional needs of the child such parents are called foster parents next point is why do people adopt children There can be many reasons for which people adopt a child. Some couples cannot have their own child, so they adopt a child. Some couples adopt children to give a home to homeless children. When a couple adopts a child, the adopted child gets all the legal rights of a member of his or her new family. Got it? Now let's summarize our chapter. The process by which living beings produce more of their kind is called reproduction. Animals that give birth to young ones are called mammals. All mothers possess the natural ability to nurse their babies. Adoption is a process by which couples become legal parents of a child who was not born to them there are many reasons why people adopt children so here we have completed our chapter second i hope you all have understood the chapter now read the chapter twice at home and find out 10 hard words okay bye bye